Listen, my boobs aren't gonna touch themselves. Her hands are always on her tits, and my hands are always on her tits. <laughs> All right, hi guys. My oh, name's sorry. Lisa. You're do your thing. This is my girlfriend Sam. That's me. <laughs> Don't sound too excited. <laughs> Whatever. All right, we are gonna do a video that has, like, people have wrote this on our Instagram pictures, they have put this in my Tumblr ass, they have tweeted us this, they, mm -hmm. because her and I Bat both have signals. tattoos. Yeah, seriously, everyone has asked for us to do a tattoo tag. And so, of course, I had to look that up. So she has, 30 tattoos, but if we did all 30 for tattoos... I mean, y'all would be sitting here for like 20 minutes easily. Yeah. So we're gonna not gonna waste the your time. ones that actually mean something. All right, my first tattoo is right here. It says, we must remember to play after every storm and to celebrate the gift of life as we have it, or else life becomes a task rather than a gift. And that was my very first tattoo, and it was written by a nine-year-old kid named Maddie Stepanek who died, um, he had a life-threatening disease, and I like the message that it had, so I got it, and that one and the one on my shoulder, which it says I refuse to sink, and the one on my arm right here, the elephant, which means the remover of obstacles, um, all of those three kind of have to do with like the same thing, which you guys know what that is because I made a video about it. it. Had to do with like my childhood, so you can watch that video if you want to know what that is. Mm -hmm. It's the very first video on the channel. Breaking. No, the second, technically the second video. Breaking. Break. Silence. Yeah, breaking the silence video. That's what those kind of mean. Mm -hmm. And then I have two on my arm. This one's it's a heart with equality. And then this one says, no freedom to we equal, like the Matthew Moore lyrics. Um, obviously. Pour it up. You know why I have that. <laughs> you gay? Mm -hmm. No, but I really like the song. I feel like it's one of those songs that like, I'm gonna hear in 10 years and it's still gonna have the same like effect that it did the first time. And I'm gay, so. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I got a gay tattoo. Oh my God, you're gay? <laughs> um, and then I have three flower. Oh, I, I guess I have, I have like a little wave that's like right here. Um, it just has to do with like California and like home. I got it when I was in Wisconsin and I was like missing home and whatever. Um, and then I have three flowers. It's the March flower, September, September, and then the May flowers. Uh, for my sister and Brenda and Trinique, three people I've known forever, and I feel like I'll always be friends with, so I got flowers for them. <coughs> yeah. So those are my tattoos. You can go ahead. You can oh, me. Huh? Well, we'll start with this one that like is my most recent one. Um, it's for my sister when she came out to visit. Um, it's her birthday, October 16th. Um, 1994 and we got them in uh, the Roman numerals and she got mine on hers. We've always wanted to do like a sister tattoo but just never really uh, knew like what we wanted and whatever. Um, I have this one on my wrist. It has my parents initials, my dad and my mom, or my mom and my dad, oops, <laughs> um, and music note um, and a heart and peace um, because I grew up in a really <laughs> I grew up in a really musical household, oh, <laughs> and I love my parents. <laughs> yeah, it's not funny. <laughs> and I love my parents, and um, yeah. it says perfect. I was like, you know what? You don't really have to be perfect. Fuck perfect. So yeah, fuck perfect. Fuck perfect. Exactly. And it's sweet with math. I got it for my dad because, again, grew up in a really musical household. He plays the drums. He taught me, you know, sing stuff like that. Um, and that's one of his favorite albums, which I personally believe it's like one of the best albums of all times. And we kind of share that belief and stuff. So I kind of got that as tribute to him and to the great songwriters of Fleetwood Mac. 
And then this one here, it says Grammy Angel because when my grandmother, um, when I lived in Connecticut, which I previously did, um, I would drive back and forth to Cape Cod, which it's like a two and a half, three hour, depending on what time you go, um, drive. And I would go back each weekend and I was the, I'm, um, okay, so I still am the NASCAR driver in my family. <laughs> Um, and my grandmother always used to say, you know, Sam, stop speeding, you know, Grimmy Angel's on your shoulder, she's watching you. Um, so I got that for her. That's actually also for my grandmother. Um, it's a set of lungs. It says her name, Sandy, and then her birth date, and then, um, when she passed away. So I got this after she passed away, obviously, um, from lung cancer. And it's just kind of a tribute to her. Um, it's got the like lung cancer like awareness ribbon and stuff like that. Okay, this is for my great grandmother. Again, her birthday and then um, when she passed away as well. So, mm. well, so yeah, if you want to like actually see like good quality pictures of yeah. the tattoos. They're gonna be on our Instagram. Stock them. Uh, yeah. Do it. You might have to dig a little yeah. bit, but go back we like will, 80 weeks. We will put our Instagrams down below. Also, like I promised, if the last video had gotten 500 likes, which it exceeded by a lot, that we would make Moose an Instagram. Mm -hmm. And so we did. So you can follow Moose on Instagram. <laughs> Moose with the caboose. Moose with the caboose. I'll put her um, Instagram down <laughs> below too so you can go and follow that. All right, so yeah, that was the tattoo tag. Yeah. Great. Holla. If you want to see us do any more videos, just put those in the comments. And we will see you next week. Make it weird. Don't make it weird. Quiet, no credits. Oh.